Hi, I'm Anna Schaffer and I play Ruby Button. Hi, I'm Jasmine Franks and I play Esther. You do, don't you? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> Esther does feel guilty, because um, if she hadn't tried to stop the wedding, then none of it would have happened. Um, Maddie wouldn't have been driving so fast. And all that. So she, she is feeling guilty, she's, she's feeling lonely. So how do you think that Esther is dealing with the online bullying? Because it's quite a lot different to the bullying that's happening in the, in the main show, kind of face to face with her, isn't it? Yeah, I think with Esther, with the online bullying, it's, it's like no escape. She, she goes to college, she has to deal with what she does, with what people are doing at college, like the little pranks and things like that. And then she goes home and as soon as she turns on a computer, as soon as she looks at her phone, a video has been uploaded, people are writing comments, she can't get away from it. She's on her own, basically. I think um, the trolls are writing things on um, Docu about Esther because they know that they're writing them things anonymously, so Esther doesn't know who is writing them things. She can go into college and she could be sat next to the person. And she wouldn't even know. And she wouldn't yeah. have a clue that that person's been writing horrible things. They don't see the effects of when Esther's sat at home and she's on a computer, she's reading these things. They don't see her, they don't see how upset she is. It's so easy for them to do that and for them to do that to Esther and um, they do, no one really realises just how much it affects her, probably. No, and I think they sit there thinking, well, knowing that they can get away with yeah. it. And so that, that then gives them a power. So they feel, that, well, I can do this, no one's going to find out, and she's going to feel even worse about herself. So what do you think that Esther could do to kind of help herself? I think maybe she should have told, told people. She should have told Frankie and Jack first off, but yeah. because of everything that was going on, she thought she could handle it. She didn't want to add more pressure to the family. And I think what with Ruby being in the house also, that even if she did sit down with Frankie, the first thing Frankie's going to do is, Ruby here, let's try and sort this out. And I think that would have just made it worse. And I think it's really difficult. It's so easy to say, go and tell someone, but actually plucking up the courage to yeah. confide in someone else is really, really difficult. And it's also admitting that you're being bullied. I think that's... That's one thing, it's like, no one wants to say I'm being bullied. Yeah, maybe someone's picking on you, maybe someone's not being very nice, but to turn around and say, I'm being bullied, I don't want to go to college, is, is a massive thing. As soon as something happens, you just need to tell someone, whether that's a teacher or a friend or a relative. It's like the cyber mentors, um, where we beat bullying, you can go and talk to them anonymously, people that have been in the same situation as you, um, maybe have been in that situation, have got out of it, and now, better people, um, you can go and speak to them and they get help from them, confined them. But there's always someone to yeah. speak to. I think it's important to remember that there is light at the end of the tunnel, even when things seem like they're really, really awful, like that it will get better. Well, people that I've spoken to um, with regards to the storyline, people who've been bullied, um, that sort of thing, there's one thing that's the same in every single one of their stories is it got a hell of a lot easier when I spoke to someone about it, even if it was someone that they didn't know. A lot of people use the cyber venturing with beat bullying. Um, so if you are being bullied and if you do feel quite lonely, I'd definitely go and check that out and have a look online. Yeah. See, because you might just make some friends on there. Someone's always there to give you a big hug when you Aww. need it most.